Hey beautiful, I am sitting at my dressing table, which is where I do my makeup, get ready in the morning. Um, but I thought I would share with you today my nighttime beauty regime. So a lot of people ask me what products I use on my skin, what kind of my regime is, so I thought I would share it with you today. First things first, I'll tie up my hair because my hair pretty much gets in the way of everything with the beauty regime, you gotta do. So just like a kind of loose bun tied up. No kind of special hair tricks here. Um, and then I like to take my makeup off with coconut oil. So I find this is a really good makeup remover, really natural. The oil seems to sort of remove everything really well. So this is RMS Beauty Coconut Oil. And I basically just take off a bit, maybe like, I don't know, half a teaspoon and warm it in my fingers because coconut oil just starts to melt once you put it on your skin. Um, and then I just kind of massage it into my skin because I've got some makeup on at the moment and I need to take it off. Um, so I give my eyes, you're gonna see panda eyes in a second, just to be warned. Um, and then kind of massage it everywhere. I've got some like skin makeup on, some eye makeup on, um, some lipstick on, all sorts of things on. <laughs> So just give it a good massage around the face. And then I take it off with um, some cotton buds. So these are just some really nice, soft, organic cotton buds um, that I use. So this is definitely around the eyes just to take off that makeup first. Blech. I always find when I'm like out and about in the day, on the tube, how dirty my face gets. Even if I'm not wearing makeup, it's always kind of amusing to come home with all that dirt on your face <laughs> but I love washing my face I know it sounds silly but it's like one of my favorite things to do it's just like that really nice like ritual of kind of cleansing off the day so once I've taken off my makeup now it's time to actually wash my face um, so I like to get some warm water and just get like a flannel and dip it into the warm water and then just put it over my face this opens up my pores and just sort of gives it a nice bit of warmth. And then I'm using a Gentle Face Exfoliator. This is by Liz L. This is a really nice cleanser. It's like a gentle exfoliant so it doesn't like scrub your skin off or make it irritated or anything like that. It's got really small beads so I'll just get one pump, sort of start warming it in my fingertips and then massaging it onto my skin. So I start from the chin and just go in like circular motions and then start working up towards the temples and then come a little bit higher, work up towards the temples. I personally find I get like most blackheads and kind of skin issues around this area so I definitely give it a good like working in, really massage in there. Get all the dirt out. And then onto the forehead. Just in like little circular motions, working out towards the temples. And then around the eyes. And then take it off with the warm water and the flat arm. And these beads can sometimes get stuck in your eyebrows. I don't know if you ever get that with exfoliating, <laughs> but I often find like, sometimes in the night, <laughs> I find like a little exfoliating bead in my eyebrow. So, always make sure we get it out. And then I'll just dry my face. Just give it a nice little pat down. Cool, so all clean nice and fresh um, and now it comes on to serum time so I'm using an origin serum um, called original skin renewal serum um, love the pretty pink packaging um, so I just normally use two pumps into my fingers just warm them in my hands and then I just pop it onto my skin so just patting it everywhere even onto the neck as well and then just again working up towards the temples, just putting it on, just gently. 
I really like this serum, it's very fresh, very light, it just kind of feels like it really sinks into the skin, especially after a nice deep clean. Just give it a good little pat. And then next is eye cream, also by Origins, I love the colour, this is called Jazing, <laughs> which is a great name, and it's pink, um, so I just put a little bit onto my fingertips. And then with eye cream, it's about not putting it right in here, into the bags, um, but just around the bone. So kind of start from the eye bone all the way around into the eyebrows as well. And just give it a nice pat and just start getting like a good amount of blood flow and circulation here. And then I give my eyes a nice massage. So just going around and around in circles. I find that helps kind of reduce puffiness and hopefully helps with the bags and preventing wrinkles too or reducing wrinkles <laughs> Let's give it a nice light pat and keep going around and then finally I've got some face oil so this is Isla some face oil um, and it says glowing radiance for glowing radiance and um, I'm all about the glow so Anything that says glow is for me. So I probably put about three little pets onto my fingertips, again warming it in, and then just patting all over the folds. And then I give it a bit of a face massage. So I just sort of start again from the chin, working upwards and give my face a little bit of massage. It's always nice to give yourself a little bit of love, so kind of do this is another technique that I learned from a facialist where you get two fingers and you just go up and down like this <laughs> smoothing out the skin and just really getting that oil everywhere and so it soaks into the skin and I know a lot of people think that oil makes their skin too oily or breaks makes it break out but I find for my skin personally it's so great, it really moisturises that I often get quite dry skin um, on my cheeks and oh my god my skin just loves the oil, it just soaks it in and, and absolutely loves it. So that is me done, um, skin is all ready for sleep. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed my nighttime regime. Um, if you've got a really good nighttime regime, make sure you leave a comment below. I love hearing about other people's and the beauty products they're using. So if there's any beauty related videos you want to see me make, make sure you leave a comment below. Um, I love hearing from you. Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and I will see you next time.